it's late November and we're here at Fenway Park for, believe it or not, Boston College football. The last time Boston College played a football game here was 1956 against Holy Cross. It has a quite a different feel to it as the end zones go from the bullpen down to the third baseline. But the Holy War has a lot of history to it as they face Notre Dame and some former players came back to share some of those memories. I remember my old coach always said it's a schlabernacker, but whatever you call it, you can call it whatever you want. You, you know what you're going to get into. It's going to be a tough physical game, and uh, it's always personal. It was not just a regular football game. It was personal out here, so I'm excited to watch. Wow, just a great rivalry, uh, a lot of emotion, uh, just a lot of pride, you know, and a lot of kids that do go to Notre Dame or go to BC kind of come from similar backgrounds, and uh, a lot of the guys that went to BC, you know, they take it personally. It was always very emotional for me. Um, specifically, I grew up in the Midwest, so Notre Dame is a big game personally. But then again, a lot of our guys had connections one way or another, either were recruited or had friends who played for Notre Dame. So this is a huge game for us. With the Irish being the home team, it has been a sea of green here in Boston. But if you're looking to support the maroon and gold, besides the VC band here, you have to head across the street to House of Blues, because that's where it was BC proud. Uh, it's insane, you know, like BC used to play here all the time back in you know, the early 20th century. It's a real historic ballpark to play in. Uh, BC's used to playing in Yankee Stadium and now they're playing here in Fenway Park. Uh, I think it's pretty cool. Um, you know, it, it's a home game for Notre Dame, but you know, that's fine because they still get it. It's like a home game for uh, BC too, so, you know, win-win. It's awesome. I'm, I'm glad to be with a, a house full of the BC community. Um, I actually am a season ticket holder for the last two years, so really passionate about football and excited to uh, be cheering on the Eagles here. No one wants to talk about moral victories, but the BC Eagle football team certainly poured their heart and soul into this one, even though they lost 19 to 16 to the fourth ranked Notre Dame Fighting Irish. But in all, it will be an experience that the BC team and their fans will never forget. For BCEagles.com, I'm Jamie Parker.